be on this real quick that there are no black holes. Didn't we get a Not picture of a black hole? Like this year? That's just CGI. Well, you've got to be you know, very dubious about these things. It's quite possible the black holes are phenomena built upon a presuppositional model, but they actually haven't got it right. It could possibly be something else. Ultimately, the distance to this thing is probably... Black holes don't prove that the Earth, right? Like, there could be black holes who yeah. care. No, no, it's CGI. Around Jupiter. Listen, think of it like know. this. If you're building a story, right, to convince somebody, or if you're building, like, a video game, and you obviously you want to flip, like, you want to basically make the entire story and how the world in the video game works, you know, as good as possible. Like, you want to have an explanation for most things, and you want to add more things to it so it feels, you know, more convincing. That's what they're doing with the black hole. They're just adding elements to deceive you. It's like adding uh, details to a story. Like, you can go out and get uh, the engineer's annual for the Manelian Vulcan, or you can go to Star Wars and figure out how a warp drive works. You know, it can give you lots and lots of intricate details, but these things don't fundamentally exist. They just exist within the story, and they give you warp drive to prove space. Exactly. So, RDM, can you, do you know what we mean now? And by the way, RDM, may I ask you on which side of the spectrum we are on? Are you in the middle of it? Are you... Flat Earth, Globe Earth, centered. Nope. Yeah. You want to answer my question or? What's the question? Oh, I was just ask asking RDM here on which side of the spectrum he is if he's. Oh, on the I was AFK. Okay, sorry. So what's so your you... question relating to? So what do you think the Earth is? Do you believe it's a spinning, funny, globy? Well, that was, that's what I was raised to believe, but I'm just here to learn, you know. Yeah, that's good. I learned about the ice wall and the land outside of it, and what that dude, who I forgot his name. Why are you laughing? I'm not laughing, I was coughing, sorry, my microphone probably picked it up weirdly because I muted myself. Well, there was a dude who I forgot his name, but he ventured outside of the ice wall, known as Antarctica. And he found Michael. the land. Was his name like Michael? I don't know. Something with Michael, I think. Though. You're talking about Admiral Bird. What? You're talking about Admiral Bird. Maybe. I think Admiral was in his name. Admiral Bird? I don't know. He got outside of the wall and he wrote books about it, I think. I also heard he found uh, aliens, an alien race, and like there was a giant battle down there. Oh, did they have like a laser a cannon fight? Did they have like a lightsaber fight? The aliens versus the like space, like like uh, aircrafts and stuff. But yeah, I if, heard there light, about that. if there were lightsabers, this... light, yeah, lightsaber fights. So they had a big before. lightsaber at the at the tip of it. Well, that's why they don't tell you about it, because they don't want you to know. Like, they don't want you so to have don't... the land. The land outside of the ice walls for the rich and powerful, according to him. And there's lightsabers and stuff. So technically, you could shape... Well, anyways, I think we can just all agree that the government's hiding some rather more advanced technology to profit from it. Like, healthcare department especially, and all that stuff. But why would there so be it's a probably moose also technology, behind the like, wall? Like, why was there oh, a moose? You know? The moose probably had something to do with the uh, zero-point energy generator that was located over there. They are probably doing some tests on some stuff. Why would they bring a moose, though? Oh, they made the moose. Potentially more, the... you know? Multiple moose. Yeah, it's like listening to the History Channel. No, they create life there. So it was like an artificial moose? Yeah, it's like a cloning facility.